Hey everyone, this is Zach Sabo, the director of the interactive short film Faded Orange. Now this is a project that I made about ooh, six months ago or so, and I uh, finally released in April, and I'm happy to say that I'm making it available on YouTube as a playthrough, which is what I'm going to bring you through right now. So in case you haven't been able to download the film, I'm going to bring you through one version of the film, that is one pathway you can take in the movie. And there are three distinct endings, and there's a few other different paths in between that you can take, but for this video, since I'm making just one YouTube video, it's going to be just one of these pathways. So making that available to you, since you guys uh, probably may not have seen the version on my website, downloaded the actual game, because it does take a little while. So. As a teaser, I'm doing an entire playthrough of the film, and I'm going to choose the exact path that we take, so enjoy the film, here we go. Sergei Eisenstein was one of the first to conceptualize editing. To me, what stands out on page 46 is his idea that art is conflict. It's counterpoint, and film is audiovisual counterpoint. Art is at the intersection of nature and industry, which produces a dialectic what he calls dynamism, both in the space-time continuum and in our very concept of rationality. This is going to be important as you begin editing your final projects, as you consider what choices you'll make. Is this a joke? What the? It's me, Michael. I know this is strange, but I'm writing this to you 10 years in the future. The reason why I'm contacting you is that I have a regret that I want to make right. There's a student in your class named Olivia Kaplan. Her mother died of breast cancer just three months ago, and Olivia never recovered from the trauma. Tomorrow, I want you to acknowledge her in front of the class for her hard work. I know it's not protocol to do this, but please do this for her, for me. There's more I will tell you tomorrow, and I hope you won't have to understand the hard way. Michael Radcliffe.
Thank you. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too. Hey, Michael. How are you, dear? Cheery as always. Can't decide if I'm daydreaming or having a nightmare. Don't know which. Teaching will do it to you. Have a seat. Hey, I'd like to introduce to you Mr. Alex Bates, our new interim faculty for the English department. Michael Radcliffe, Department of Visual Arts. Pleasure. Likewise. So how are the kids this semester? It's a tough one, Michael. Everyone's always having these side conversations. Starting to believe lately that I'm back teaching high school again. No kidding. Hey, but on a more serious note, I've been trying to find out about a student on my roster. She may have issues. Issues? Like psychologically, emotionally, I'm not sure. There's no record of it, but hey, I'm, I might be hallucinating, Michael, but. Don't trouble yourself, Amy. Maybe it's not as bad as you think. But what if it is? I mean, a lady like Good morning, class. I said good morning. Good morning. So I'm going to take roll now, since I'm still getting used to all your names and faces. Joseph Carpenter. Present. David Vincent. Dakota Garcia. Olivia Kaplan. Rochelle Larson, Wee Liu, Jia Li, Austin Osler, Hannah Winkler, Tao Zhang. All right, I usually don't do this, but I'd like to acknowledge one of our top students. She's done a phenomenal job, and I see great success in her future, Olivia Kaplan. Olivia? Tomorrow is Olivia's last day. She's going to jump off the roof of the telecom building on campus, 15 minutes before 4 p.m. I want you to be there to stop her. I didn't want to tell you this the first time to scare you, but due to a change in the histories, her death has approached sooner than anticipated. Please, rid this regret from me, Michael. Round two. Michael, Michael, I'm, I'm really worried. What's wrong? That troubled student I was telling you about, she keeps running out the door. I think she's in serious danger. I, I don't know exactly what we can do, but, but we have to do something. I, she's at some kind of breaking point. I, I don't know what, but we've got to do something. We've got to help her. Is her name Olivia Kaplan? How did you know? So, what's the plan?
this. I know it sounds crazy, but we got a letter from ourselves ten years in the future. They told us you were going to be here, and we regretted that we couldn't save you. They also told us about your mother. She passed away three months ago to breast cancer, right? Look, my wife also suffered from that too. I know what it's like to feel abandoned, but you can't give up. We love you, Olivia. If you can't do it for yourself, at least do it for your mother, please. Oh, my God. 